channel so today I wanted to do a get ready with me type um, it's literally after one o'clock right now and I'm just now getting ready for the day um, most days I don't get ready but I have some time right now both the boys are asleep um, Holden's in our room and Maverick's asleep in his room um, but yeah I just wanted to do some of my makeup and um, just a quick makeup video and also show you how I curl my hair just have my hair curled um, for the day, nothing special, but I did want to announce that I have become a brand ambassador with Dottie Couture. If you don't know what that is, it is a boutique in Indianapolis. They have one in Fishers, one in Greenwood, <clears throat> and then one at Keystone, um, which is like the fashion mall of Indianapolis. And a little bit about Dottie, they have very affordable clothing, very comfortable clothing, great quality clothing. Um, it is a boutique and the owner's name is Brooke. She is seriously the sweetest person ever. I honestly, the first time I ever interacted with her, I didn't even know she was an owner. I just thought that she worked there. Um, she was super, super helpful at the boutique. Um, Maverick was five months old because she asked how old he was and I remember the whole conversation. Um, she's so sweet. And Dottie actually does an amazing thing where they give a percentage of all of their profits for the year to Make-A-Wish Foundation. Brooke, her mom, and her daughter Taylor all are cancer survivors. I'm not quite sure of what cancer, um, but I know they all three had cancer. And Taylor is a young girl. Like, she is maybe 10, 12-ish. I feel like I'm butchering that. She's probably, like, 15. I don't know. But, um... This, just the sweetest family. Brooke is a foster mom, um, very involved in the community. It's just such a great organization to be supporting and I'm so glad that I am an ambassador because all of my clothes are from Dottie. Um, <clears throat> okay, let me rephrase that. All of my good clothes are from Dottie. So like all of my good shirts, all my good jeans, all from Dottie. And I will post my affiliate link below that you can use if you want to support me and Dottie. Um, you can click on that link. And actually, if Dottie is having a better sale than 20% off, because if you use my code COURT20, you get 20% off. But if Dottie is having a better sale than 20% off, like they do, thir like for Halloween, they did 31% off. Um, so if they have something like that going on, you can use my link and still support me, but also get the best deal possible through Dottie, which I think is absolutely amazing. A lot of brands do either or. Um, you can either support somebody or if they're running a better special, you can do that. But the person that you got that referral from doesn't get anything from it. Um, I do get 10% of all purchases. So I'm not gonna lie, I do get something out of it, but I, even if I didn't, I've been supporting Dottie for so long. I remember at my bridal shower, somebody asked me where I got my dress and I did this whole spiel over Dottie and how amazing they are. And I will always, always promote Dottie just because I think that they're such a good organization and it's an indie boutique. So it's not like you're giving, you know, some CEO in California your money. You're giving a, a local family your money, which I think is so important. Um, my mirror is over here, so to do my makeup, I'm going to have to look over here, um, but I will show you guys all of my products as we do this. So I got this from the Tarte sale they had, uh, I think two weeks ago. They had seven, six products and a free makeup bag for $63, which is amazing. Like, I use the Tarte foundation all the time, and this guy, and it is $39 by itself. So, such a great deal, but I think it's over with at this point. But 
I just wanted to show you. So this is the Tarte Foundation. This is the Amazonian Clay Full Coverage. Um, I use the shade 22B Light Beige. Here is their palette that I got as well. Um, I don't know the Leave Your Mark palette. Here's some of the colors. Here is their mascara. This is the Lights Camera Flashes and it is like a leather case. Like this is the actual like mascara tube, which is, I just think is so cool. This is the Ready Set Radiant. So it's a setting spray. It says skin mist. So I think I read online that you can use this as kind of like a primer mist, um, but I use it as a setting mist. I don't know if you can really see that. <clears throat> then I got their Tarte Lip Paint in the shade Exposed. But it's like a really pretty nudish light pink color. And then I could have got the shape tape, but I didn't. I got the Rainforest of the Sea Aqua Sealer Concealer. And I just got the shade Fair. So that's what I got from the Tarte sale and then my bag. So I'm gonna use these products today. Okay, so to start off with makeup, I usually use a primer. I was a unique consultant for a little bit, so I still have some of their primer. I'm just gonna use this. Otherwise, I use the Benefits Professional, but I'm actually out right now, so. I just use this all over. And I forgot to um, dampen my beauty blender before I came in here. So we're gonna try it with a dry beauty blender and just see how it goes. If anything, I'll just use my fingers. So my beauty blender, which is janky and needs replaced, but it's fine. It's fine. I'm actually just gonna use my fingers. I think that's the better option today. And this is like a lot. You do not need this much. I don't actually know why I just did all of that, but so, yeah. And then, put that back. Then I will go in with the Rainforest of the Sea Concealer, like this. looks super cute. I'm actually going to use my beauty blender for this.
see if this were like a real beauty guru video they would have told you to do your eyes first but like I forget I never wear eyeshadow so but I want to use this Tarte palette we're just gonna go for it we're just gonna try it but I really like the way that um like when you have like really light eyelids and then like a darker outside I don't know if that's like a thing but I think it looks good when people have that so now that I'm done doing like my face though I'm gonna put my hair down so I don't look like a naked mole rat so yeah okay so I'm going to use this grace palette or this grace color on my whole lid any different <sighs> okay and then I'm going to take this little fluffier brush it's like a little actual circle and I'm going to use this shake it off color I think yeah I'm gonna use the shake it off color let's see grace and shake it off let's see what kind of combo that makes You can kind of see it. I thought it was too light. I just now realized that I have a little mirror right here that I could be using this whole time instead of over here. So it's fine. I'm so pale. <laughs> okay, so there's that. And then I'm just going to line that. Okay, that was Holden waking up, so I'm gonna try to hurry this up. So I'm going to do those really quick. And I used the Anastasia Beverly Hill Dip Brow Pomade in the color Blonde. And this stuff lasts forever. I'm actually not going to have time to curl my hair because he's waking up. So I guess that is life goes he'll probably go right back to sleep after I nurse him but he just doesn't like being alone <coughs> Ooh, and I can't even be mad at him because neither do I See, look at my eyebrows. Look at how different those look. And I'm not like one of those crazy like overliner people, but you know. Just 
just gives them like a nice little darker coat so that you don't look like you have nothing. But okay, Holden is officially awake. So that is it for this video. Um, I really hope you guys liked it. I will just set this really quick. Okay, and that is it. So if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and stay tuned for more videos. Um, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.